What's up, people? This mob tube thing, it's fucking nuts. Last night, well, Patrick Bet David is doing a good, uh, it's like a sit down of nice long uh, series with Sammy the Bull and Michael Frenzies. And that shit got heated last night. But here's my thing Sammy the Bull lost his mind, he went bananas. Michael, who's typically calm and collected, went back and forth. They, you know, they argued back and forth. I think it was over something that Michael said in one of his, uh, one of his videos about Sammy testifying or something like that. And Sammy took it, you know, he got sensitive about it. But the truth of the matter is, you know, Sammy did cooperate, testify. He sent 36, uh, 36 guys to prison. That was a decision he made, decision that he made, and uh, he's got to live with it. People are going to criticize, people are going to have an issue with it. It's just the way it is. Uh, Francis, I'm not sure, I don't think anybody went to prison for his testimony. I know he did cooperate a little bit, but I'm not sure how deep it was. I don't think any major players went to prison. He still read it, there's no doubt about it. You know, he still, he still states evidence, there's no doubt about it. But, and he owns up to it. He's, he has no problem with it. He's, uh, he did what he did. He testified against this guy, Norby Walters or some shit. I don't know the specifics, you know, the specifics of the case, but he did, uh, he did testify also. And he's not sensitive about it. He just, he owns it. He did what he did and that's it. But Sam, he goes, got nuts on him about it for criticizing about him, uh, him going bad. He did go bad. He's a rat. Sammy's a rat, obviously. Michael's a rat, obviously. Anybody that testifies or gives uh, information is a rat, right? It is what it is. It's okay. If you did it, just own up to it and move along. Be confident with the decision that you made. If that's the decision that you made, be confident of it, but be prepared for people to criticize. People don't typically like rats. I mean, you know, it's just... It's not a good thing. It's not a good thing. And if people are going to call you out on it, you just got to go with it. Be honest about it. And roll with the punches. So I'm looking forward to this uh, this, uh, this series. I think it's 10 hours of footage with Sammy and Michael, Chas Palminteri, Rudy Giuliani, and Patrick uh, Patrick's team. You know, driving the, driving the show. So let's see how it goes. The fact of the matter is, Michael Francis did testify in court. I also think he testified against boxing. I am not sure. I didn't. I didn't look that much into it. Michael Francis testified. Sammy the Bull testified against major, major, uh, major players. Guy from my neighborhood got life because of Sammy's testimony about a hit in Queens. I think in the story of Queens. So the impact of Sammy is great. It's far and wide. So it's okay that you did it. I'm not saying it's okay. I'm not condoning it. It's just uh, you have to understand that people are going to be, uh, you know, they're going to call you out on it. All right. They call it mob tube. I don't know what the fuck it is. But uh, there's all kinds of guys on this mob tube thing right now. Some stay on topic, some get off topic. The ones that get off topic, you can watch for five minutes and you shut it off. If they stay on topic, keep it short, keep it sweet, keep it simple, under an hour. On the genre, they'll have a good show. They start fighting with each other, going back and forth. You lose interest of the people that are interested in the genre. They don't like that drama bullshit and they go away. I unsubscribe to a few already. I'm not going to mention all their names. It's not worth it. But, uh, you know, this is what it is. The mob genre situation on, on YouTube has gotten way out of control. All right, I'm checking out. Have a happy Thanksgiving.